back. I am your host, Mecca. So a few of you guys have been asking me where I get all my clothes from. If you guys have seen my clothing hauls and my lookbooks, which I will link up here, I shop at the thrift store. And it's a great place if you're like Muslim or you're looking for something that's not like mainstream clothing. Thrift stores are a great economical choice as well because you can go recycle your clothes. And I know some of you may be like wary of wearing clothes that people have. But what I actually do is just buy things from the thrift store and then I wash it. I always have trouble finding like long sleeve shirts that go all the way down. Um, dresses that aren't like super tight. It's really hard out here for Muslim girls. And we all don't have... $60 to spend on a jilbab or a buyer or whatever these sisters are charging for their um, <laughs> their clothes. I don't know about you guys, but I don't wear like jilbabs, a bias, things like that. I like not regular clothes, but clothes that are more suited to my culture. So are, I'm American, of course, so I'm used to jeans, shirts, pants, like things like that, sneakers, heels, things like that. Um, the only difference is I have to wear a hijab, I have to make sure my clothes are like loose enough, and things like that. So shopping at like Forever 21 and Fashion Nova, sometimes those stores just don't work because a lot of the clothes that people want to wear are like revealing, kind of almost borderline naked, like it's really hard to shop while you're a Muslim. Um, so what I do is I go to the thrift store which has like clothes that people aren't really like trying to shove themselves into so it's like more long sleeve shirts you have a really great variety so um I always get my dresses there I get some of my scarves there I get I used to get shoes there but I don't anymore um but really all you have to do is like pick through things because I know like sometimes you guys don't want to wear clothes that other people have worn but I'm gonna tell you guys it's okay you can just wash it um, I also take all the clothes I grew, grow out of or don't really like, I take them to the thrift store to donate them as well. So you're like giving back and recycling and it's really helping the environment. Um, I started off doing it because my family didn't have a lot of money and there were seven kids um, and two adults of course. <laughs> so you gotta be like frugal with your money. But then I mean like I've always liked it. I've never been ashamed of like shopping at a thrift store. Like why would I? Um, recently in the past like five or ten years it's become like a trend. People want to be more economically friendly and so they're like oh yeah I shop at the thrift store. That's like you know I recycle things like that. It's kind of like the recycling craze that everybody was on. That's how I fill my closet up every time because I would not be able to have all these clothes if I had to pay twenty dollars per item or more. So I on average I pay five to six dollars per item and most of the time I go on half off days. So what I would recommend for the Muslim women that are struggling to find like clothes that fit or like loose enough, um, one option is to go to the thrift store and see what you guys can find it. Because if you just Google Maps the thrift store, I'm sure you'll have a lot of results around you. I have about three different thrift stores surrounding me, but I have one particular one that I like that always has like deals and stuff. But it's kinda easy to find things at the thrift store. And you can also donate your old clothes there so more people can find clothes. The second option is to find like a Muslim run business and stuff. As you guys know, I'm starting my fashion line with my sister soon. So you guys will get updated as we get updated. Um, we're gonna be making like clothes that are like not traditional jilbabs because not every girl my age wears jilbab. I don't know a lot of girls my age that actually like them. Um, and I understand, I don't want to wear black all the time, I don't want to wear just one long dress. I don't really like dresses, I kind of like pants. So, we're going to have a really diverse line of clothing, and I hope you guys really look forward to it. I'll be so happy to share it with you guys. Um, for now, we do have Made in Be More, which is our clothing line where it's just like sportswear. So we have like hoodies, jackets, hats, things like that. So you guys, I will leave the link down below. You guys can go check it out if you want to purchase something from there to support us. Um, and also, if you're in Maryland, we are in Towson Mall now, right by the food court. So I hope to see you guys there. If you guys have any questions or concerns or just things you want to rant about, about dressing um, while Muslim, you guys can leave it a comment down below and I might make a video addressing it because I absolutely love reading your comments and comments from Muslim women just happen to be one of the funniest things ever. Also, you guys may be wondering why I'm doing more sit-down videos. Um, I know you guys really like my outfit of the day, lookbooks, things like that. I'll link them up above if you guys haven't seen them. It's really cold outside. I don't know if you guys have seen the winter warnings and things like that, but it's snowing, it's freezing, in the low 10s, it's 9 degrees. I don't really want to be outside freezing. 
I'm gonna wait till it warms up a little bit. You'll probably get some more next week. So until then, I see you guys again soon. Bye!